Welcome back, and, um, so today is the 17th of June, and, uh, that's Brick World. So, um, like I said, let's grab my bag, and let's go to Brick World. We saw a ton of crazy stuff like this Endor mod, which I want to get inspiration from the trees. We also saw this crazy futuristic city, which just took out thousands of pieces. Then we saw this working machine. Um, these were really cool. Then we also saw a city. I mean, like, I really want to take inspiration from this, especially look at all the ducks. Like, it's really cool to see cities there and get inspiration. Then I also saw a ton of um, Lord of the Rings mocks and, like, scenes. It's like, um, that's, like, when they met Gandalf again. That's when Frodo threw the ring. That's Bibble Baggins. Like, these are all really cool, and that's the Shire, Shire coming up next, and there's, like, instructions right there, which is really cool. We read through them a bit. It's really cool to see that it took up a lot of pieces. Is that, can you do the screen thing? <laughs> <laughs> After we made a robot scream, we saw a cool castle mock with an interior. Really, really cool. Water, farms. The castle was just outstanding interiors, like I said. It was just crazy. Then we saw this other castle, which was like a floating castle with waterfalls. I love those waterfalls. I want to try and like recreate them for my mocks. All right, we got some. Be quiet. We got some halftime uh, like hall. Um, so we got some signed stuff from Brixie. Um, other people, and I'm not gonna completely. Uh, I'm not gonna completely show you, but I got a shirt, um, some capes. I got a pack of zombie heads, a king. Uh, I don't want to show everything right now, but um, I'll show you af everything after um, Brick World. We also saw the scene from Guardians of Galaxy Three, uh, Doctor Strange. Uh, I don't know what movie that one's from. Some Spider-Man No Way Home stuff, which was really cool, and we also saw. The mystery shack! Cloud City! Welcome back. And, um, as you just saw, I did indeed go to Brick World. So, um, I brought a little bag um, for all the stuff I might get. Um, you got the sign. You don't need this whole thing up here, though. Um, so, this, I'll show you, like, a little re a review of what I got. So, I've actually had this red plate, but I got it signed by a lot of famous YouTubers. I'm on our productions. Emma Soros and Ross, aka Mr. Soros, um, Brixie, Shy Time is My Time, and Cheesy Studios, he was on Brickmasters, so it was really cool. Damn, this. There we go, that's a better camera angle, so I'll just go through what I got. Let me take them off the bag. So I got this, this is pretty new, I got this new King minifigure, it's the Bear King, um, I didn't get it for, like, the minifigure. I got it for his accessories, like, this little cape and, um, his body. So I got foot soldiers from, um, oh my gosh, Ninja Turtles. So this looks like kind of a commander because of his legs. And then I got a normal one and then another normal one. So they don't have much detail on the back, just some printed. It's, like, not a really detailed minifigure, but I really like it because of like where it's from this is probably one of my favorite things i got i love this place i was at this store brick world like five times in a row so let me show you what i got uh the double head mold it, it's not real lego it's custom of course um but you know it's a zombie head mold i, I think this one might be my favorite look at this awesome really really cool head like it's so tall like, let me get, like, normal minifigure head. And then the zombie head, it might be three times as big. It's definitely not two. It's definitely three times as big. Really detailed, too. Like, of course, the back's not detailed. But, like, I would love to have, like, some zombies in my new Lego city that I'm going to be getting soon. So, um, yeah, next thing I grab. So, as you saw, I got another tall face. This guy throwing up. I wasn't sure if I was going to get this, but then, um red bricks got something there so when i was like oh i kind of want to get this too so when i bought it and then um i was walking away about to buy it with money 
and um then I saw this and I thought it looked really funny um so I ended up getting it it was I got this cool double cape that goes on both sides so it looked like that on minifig I got this really cool white one I got this like overhang black one that would go on your shoulders I, that one's gonna be cool I got a waistcoat ra waistcoat sorry for I don't even know and I got um this um so here let me let you see that a bit better uh, yeah so it's a custom gun uh that was actually all for five dollars really good price uh, bag um oh, so this this bag is special so uh, roll the clip Ty I'll get you um sir I have a bit of a challenge will you trade me anything for a fifteen dollar uh, Taco Bell gift card I don't even know if there is fifteen. I swear, has, I'm, I'm almost one hundred percent sure. I am almost one hundred percent sure. <laughs> <laughs> it's good, good content. Good content. So what do you want for it? Anything, up to you. Well, then I'll give you one little hat. Okay. No, nah, come on, you can't teach you that. <laughs> I said, why not? Let's see. He's doing it. He's doing it. So this is about twenty dollars, okay? Twenty dollars? Yes, I'm not gonna short you. Uh thank you so much. You're sir. welcome. You're so nice. Thank you. Thank you. I could use it on a trip home. Thank you so <laughs> Thank you. much. Thank Have you. a great day. Have a good one. <laughs> no way. Okay, so now that you've seen the clip, um, I want to shout out these people. Um, because this guy was super nice and uh he traded me for, as you saw, the Taco Bell gift card, which I thought was hilarious. Um so here, actually I'm not even gonna so this tile is actually M and R. I I M and R gave this to me. So, um, that's not from Eclipse Graphics. But yes, definitely go check these people out. These, they make really cool customs. So here you go, I'll leave this on the screen for a minute. Oh, sorry, my hand's shaking. So yeah, definitely go check them out. Really cool, gonna leave that right there. Check them out, they got some really cool stuff. Um, it was really nice. Uh, let's see. So and he gave me, let me do one at a time. Gave me like 20 bucks worth of custom stuff, which I just can't believe he did that. Gave me a really cool bloody dad. It's a really cool gun. Like, they all super detailed, really good, like, printing, everything. Just, um, and I think my favorite one was either the knife or this one. This one just has a really cool skin on it. It looks like it's straight out of Call of Duty. Um, like, this one is just awesome. And this one is also cool, but the other I like the other molds better. I mean, it looks crazy cool. Um, wish I could have got more of these, but um, I didn't want to. Uh, you, you saw my wallet. I'm a bit broke. I also got this. Uh, so, I didn't, oh, dang, it's female? I didn't even realize I got a female pack. Um, as you can see, 16 bucks. It's actually a really good price. Um, because every single zombie head, um, was like $3.50, uh, $3.50 each. So, I'm to get this for $16. I thought about getting two, but, you know, we gotta grow the army slowly. I already have 12 zombies. Um, this just looks like a classical zombie face, just groaning. I'll have to speed through this. Um, this is really cool. It has its brains out and just yelling. Oh, this one has a couple bullet holes in its face. That's really cool. Just this detail is crazy cool. What is this one? This one just has one big head shot on its face. Uh, let's see. Another one. Classic zombie yelling. Sorry if you can't see them the best. It's, I kind of just have to, like, do it real fast. Oh, this one's cool. He's wearing sunglasses. But he's the undead. Or she. They're all she's, apparently. Um, and then what's next? Ooh. 
this one's just another classical zombie, just like groaning, like, uh. Oh, this one I really like. It has, I think, blood all around its mouth, like it was just eating. And then, oh, this one, this one doesn't even have an eye. Wow. Some of these are really cool. Um, so, this one, it just looks like a girl zombie. Let me put them all back. So, last but not least, I got... Let me move these weapons. I don't want to lose them. I hate to do that. Let's see. Our packs were minifigures, but they're actually weapon packs. Which I was at disappointed at first because I bought a ton of them. I was like, oh, good price. Oh, I found the Brixie sticker. How did I not see that? I was like, oh, good price, you know. Um, but they apparently weren't what I thought they were. So I'm actually going to move the camera so I have a better angle. But I actually originally only bought one mystery pack. But the guy I showed you, the guy who traded me for that Taco Bell gift card, he actually gave me a free one of these because I'm a YouTuber. Um, I was pretty surprised. I didn't expect to like get anything like that. So go check out Brick Warrior. Brick Warriors. I'm so sorry. Like that was what. So he gave this to us for free. So this is awesome. So I'm probably gonna open this one first because he gave it to us for free. So we are going to move these other mystery and fantasy and castle and military packs. Um, and let's just open this up. I have no clue what's in it. I haven't opened it yet. Um. Ooh, I see gold. That's cool. Let's just pour it out. Oh, what the heck? What the heck? Ain't no way, bro. Oh, no way. There's more? And is there... Oh. I... Is that everything? Oh my gosh. Let's go through everything, everything. I got a... Oh, I'm so sorry. I got a cool hat. It's pretty cool. I got a glow in the dark. Let's see if you can see this. Where's my camera? Oh, camera. You can kind of see it. Doesn't really work. But, well, it works, but, you know, like, it's hard to see on camera. This is a really cool medieval knight helmet. This is definitely going to go in my middle earth. That's going to be my city. An awesome thing that goes over their head. A really detailed dagger. What is this? A gun. And then I got these wings, I think. I don't, I'm not quite, oh yeah, this, this part right here detaches, you can break them off, and then you can click this onto, like, some back thing. Uh, it looks like two hair pieces, these are weird hair pieces, I don't know what I'm going to use that for. This looks like it goes on top of a hat, and then this looks like a arrow. So, so next, let's see, which one do I do? I'm going to pick that randomly, I'm not looking. Oh, I almost lost this guy forever. I don't want that. Oh, another mystery pack. Okay. Let's see. See what's in there oh, what do i see i see more gold i got the same thing as last time i got two of these that's funny oh i got a jousting stick this goes on someone's body or waist i got a gun Ooh, oof, a really cool knife good detail it's on this oh like i think this goes on a viking helmet and it goes in the dark Ooh, a really cool helmet I like that one. what else did i get oh more oh, okay i don't even have one of those but yeah, I have to put it somewhere. Ooh, a really cool king sword. And, oh, there is something else. If I could get it out. Oh, ooh, another knight helmet. Yes! That's definitely kind of what I wanted. So, knight helmet, uh, king or knight sword, uh, knight helmet, chest plate or waist plate, sword, musket, wings, um, uh, jousting stick, and then these two antler pieces. Now I'm going to put this, put everything back. I like everything, but time to open this one. A little bit off camera. Let's see if you can see anything. Oh, it's really green in there. Right. Sorry to guess. All right. Um. So let's see. First thing we got is a gun. Oh, that is not a gun. It looks like something you set up something on. It's really cool. So then, what do we get? Okay, two and one. Uh, we got a cool thing, like a bandana thing, and then a thing that goes over your oh, chest plate. That's awesome. I've always wanted one of those. <gasps> two chest plates. Oh my goodness. A machine. It's. A, to me, it looks like a futuristic machine gun, but maybe it's just a normal machine gun. And then, let's see here. Ooh, a grenade launcher, maybe? Um, there's a big... Oh, another helmet! Come on, let me grab it. Ooh, did I grab two things? Another helmet, jeez. Pistol. Wish I got a bit more guns. Oh, well. It's always next brick world. Um, and then, look at that. More guns. Now, that might just be empty. Now let's open fantasy because it's first. 
Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. It's all red in there. Oh, you can see a lot of stuff that's in there. Looks like some repeats that I've already had. I'm just going to pour it all out. This looks like a... Oh, dragon head! You can put this on top of a minifigure head. This looks really cool. It's actually spiky in real life. Yeah, so we already got this one. Which, oh, where is it? So which is A-OK. -okay. Of course, I can use two. I don't know what this is. Maybe it's supposed to be like a little hay doll. Um, this looks like a wand. Really very detailed Harry Potter wand. <gasps> How did I miss this? Look at this helmet. This is going on my bestest warrior. What? I, oh, this is a shield. I like that. Another wand. So let's put that all back. Boom. All right. So let's just open this castle one. Let's get right into it. So let's see what we got. Again? Oh, my goodness. I have... This is cool. It's like some vines, but I have like four of these now. Oh, well. Just pour it all out. Um, this looks like, I don't know. This, oh, this is a quiver. Don't know how I'm supposed to get this on someone's back, though. Wow, this looks like a werewolf. It fits on someone's head, doesn't it? It's just, oops, sorry. A cool golden hat. A knife. Wait, are these supposed to come apart? This looks like a dagger, and this looks like a grenade. It might come apart. I'm not quite sure. Which has plate? Yes. Oh, wait. This might just fit. Oh, that's sick. Yeah, those fit together. Another one of those hair pieces. I, I don't know what that is. Oh, it's not empty. Oh, and a white bone arrow. Look how detailed that thing is. Oh, my gosh. This is all going to be one minifigure. If you can imagine it. So, that's everything in there. So... Boom, just like that, I want to thank out everybody that helped me. Like, Red Bricks, he was there with me the whole time. That was super fun to do it with him. Make sure to check out his video. It's probably going to be getting around the same time I get mine out. And thank you, Eclipse Graphics. Um, if I said that wrong, I'm bad at reading, sorry. Um, thank you so much. Check them out. And check out Brick Warriors. And then make sure to check out Bricks Citizen Bricks. And... Check out Brick Tactical, but especially check out Eclipse Bricks and um, Brick Warriors because they helped me a lot. Um, plus, there's a couple under other vendors where I got like this from. So it was just a really cool time. Um, thank you all for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one.